Hi guys, Joseph Rotenbach here. So I decided to experiment with displaying smooth scrolling text on a standard character LCD. I hadn't seen anyone try this before and I thought it would be a fun experiment to keep me busy during lockdown. Character LCDs have a number of blocks where each character on the screen is contained within a block. So you can't place a character in between two blocks or partially off the screen. And this is why you can't do smooth scrolling out of the box. Uh, this display has 40 blocks with 20 on each line. So if we want to scroll text the traditional way, we're going to be limited by the boundaries of those blocks and it's going to look pretty jerky. An interesting feature of most character LCDs is the ability to define custom characters. So on the display I'm using, which is based on the HD44780 controller chip, we can define up to eight custom characters, as you can see in one of these little Arduino examples. And these custom characters are exactly what we take advantage of to display our smooth scrolling text. So on the Arduino side, we define a custom font of five by seven characters, and then we define a canvas, which is a memory buffer that we'll use to store a whole string of text visually. So we start by allocating the memory for the canvas, and then we copy the pixel data for each of the font characters into the appropriate locations on the canvas. And then we have a function to map the intended locations of each of the custom characters onto positions of the canvas. So all we do is allocate some memory for each of the custom characters, and then copy over the uh, memory of that intended location on the canvas into the custom character, and then we push each of those custom characters to the display. And each time we want to scroll the text left by one pixel, we just shift the position of the custom character right one pixel on the canvas. And I was quite satisfied with how it came out. It took some fine tuning with the contrast and the scrolling speed, but all in all, it was quite a success on the display that I first tested it with. However, when I tried it on another LCD, namely this white on blue one, it doesn't look nearly as good and the text is quite blurry, um, even with playing around with contrast. So it's really one of those cases of your mileage may vary depending on the display you use. Even though it didn't turn out that great on the blue LCD, I was really happy with how it came out in the original one. I'll put the source code on my website if you want to give it a go, the link is in the description, but overall I'd call this project a great success.